Assalamualaikum, hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is day two of our Tunisia holiday and on this day we go and explore uh, a number of different places, the beachfront, the Medina and then we end the day on a pirate boat ship. So come and join us on this exciting day. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum, hello everybody. Ah, this is day two two in Tunisia and look at the view that we've got and look it's raining it's raining you probably can't see it on camera but it's raining didn't expect it to be raining in Tunisia but hey ho look at that uh, yeah you probably can't see it but it is raining so the first day in Tunisia was very hot very very hot it's like sweaty clammy oh can you hear it the thundering oh the thundering wow yes yeah, so yesterday very hot and sweaty we didn't really leave the hotel we were just getting used to it we did go and do some swimming in the pool and in the ocean and then uh, we had some food at the restaurant We'll do a, a, a tour of the restaurant at some point today. Oh yeah, oh yeah, look at, listen to that. Listen to that. Wow, it's going to be interesting. Interesting. That's a bad angle. You can see me. the thunder and lightning Ooh. I'm gonna get off and get ready and actually start the day okay bye said I've been Go in the water again. Yes, we're not now. We're gonna go out today. So where's my goggles? Where's your goggles? There's your goggles. You're gonna go out into the pool today, are you? Yeah. Yeah. And guess what? What? I went under. What I just saw under. Under but where? I just saw underneath, and then guess what? What? I was swimming, but only for like two seconds. Alright, okay. Come on, let's, let's go. go. Let's go. So it's time for breakfast. So let's see what food is on offer for breakfast time at this Tunisian hotel. The breakfast at the Turkish hotel was fantastic. There was a wide range of food available. Lots of cheeses, lots of dairies, lots of meat options, lots of um, sweet options, lots of pastries, um, lots of drink options as well. So let's see what this has got. Well, straight off, there's a dedicated bar section for um, pork. So people that like bacon in the morning. Uh, this hotel's got you covered. Uh, I guess they need to cater for all clientele. One thing I found at the hotel, especially during the lunch times, the breakfast times, um, the dinner times, is it's always packed. It's so busy. And when people come out and want food, they all come at the same time, which is fair enough. But every, all the food is in close proximity to everything, so there, there isn't a lot of um, there isn't a lot of space. One of Ahil's and myself favorite station is this one here. This is where they make um, pancakes, fresh pancakes with 
plenty of chocolate sauce. As this hotel is very French inspired, the, the pastries are very good. Lots of croissants, lots of um, French type <laughs> breads and buns. Um, so that was nice. Uh, to be fair, I enjoyed uh, the breakfast service a lot more than the service. Yeah, there's so many people here. Just queues and queues and queues. Yeah, but well, we have come in August, so peak holiday season. We had palms because it's full of palm trees with dates in them. Is this a, is this a little brat? Hello. Look at here. Later. To make a start on our travels in Tunisia. Um, we decided to go for a walk along the beachfront after our breakfast. So we're going to come yeah. straight out of our hotel, take a left, and follow that road as far down as we can along the beach. Take it in the sights. Uh, also, as it's raining, we're going to get a little bit wet, a little bit drenched, but that's fine. It's really warm at the moment, so the rain is actually helping to cool us down. Watch the water. Did it yeah, it's been raining. I didn't expect it to be raining in Tunisia. I thought it's gonna be very hot. It is hot. No, really. I to ride. it's a little bit milder today. Our first walk in Tunisia. Lucky yeah. time this is where we came out yesterday. Hmm? The snooker place. We're going to do some snookering. Snooker place? Huh? What is it? Snooker place? They do they play snooker. What? Snooker?
while it looks a little bit damp and dingy it was actually pretty mild it's still very hot at this time in the morning but the fact there was lots of cloud coverage and looked a little bit subdued it was actually nice it was a nice walk for the first thing in the morning Along this road, on the right hand side, we came across a number of hotel resorts that just looked derelict or were in construction but never got completed and it's quite a lot of that. It's raining again. Oh my goodness, look at this. Cool isn't it? Yeah. Cool yeah, rain. Yeah, Good thing we've got a waterproof sports camera. Yeah. This is like a very extended beach like live. But obviously there's no stones here. See, this, see the length of the beach man, all the way down there. Yeah. All the way over there. Mahusu. Shelter room. It's fine because I'm. Yeah. If I wash it, I'm gonna get more wet. Oh yeah. Yeah. Didn't expect the shelter from the rain in Tunisia. Anything else? No, sir. Yeah. Oh, no, only the tiny. Almost now. Okay, okay, right. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. So we're gonna go to Al Jam, we're just getting some directions. Okay. So you're gonna take some uh, taxi? Yeah. Then uh, tell him I want to go to the station. This name is uh, uh, Tafela. 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 Yes. Tafela. Yeah. So when you are there, there is uh, all the, the taxis yes. to all the cities in Tunisia and something like that. So you got. To take a, to go to the ticket office. Ticket office. Yeah. And tell them I want to go to the gym, so you will buy tickets for yeah. five person yeah. or something like that. Yeah. And you will take. Okay. You will take. Okay? Okay, okay. So from here I cannot, I can't, uh, I can't uh, like describe uh, from any way to go to the to the tafela because uh, you must to take two luas. Yeah. to go there and you will uh, distract or something like that so you must take a taxi and tell them tell him i want to do to go to the tafela uh, lafela tafela tafela yes so that's the station yes it's tafela. station and there yeah, is yeah. too much luas there yeah, yeah, you yeah. can take wherever you want <laughs> yeah right okay okay two hours later the sun finally come out it's all the music and everyone's on the beach we are going off on our first adventure. We're going to go to the Ribat of Sus, so it's a grand mosque. Now we're going to try and get a taxi. Let's see how that goes because we're probably going to need two because there's five of us and they only have four people in the car. So it's going to be interesting to see how we get on and if we can all get into one taxi. But that's what we're going to try and do today. It's going to be a hot one. Gonna have to put on plenty of lotion. So come along. Okay. Salam alaikum. Bye. Now to get to where we need to get to, we need to get a taxi. So conveniently, straight outside the hotel. It's a bunch of taxi drivers waiting to pick up customers. Now, as I'm new to this country and this is the first time I've actually got a taxi, 
we go up to the taxi driver and ask what the fare is to to go to the certain destination however it's uh, however it's good to haggle with the drivers because they want to get as much money out of you as they can so it's always good to, to negotiate later on though what i've realized is that the taxi driver prices are not the best prices and actually there's an app called bolt which is a bit like uber um, and i actually found that to be much better at actually um, arranging taxis and uh, also the fares and the fixed fixed prices as well yeah Busy day for you, my friend, today? Yeah. Busy? Busy? Yeah. Hot day as well? Yeah. Very hot. Very, very hot. <laughs> very yeah. hot, yes. Oh. Traffic is like finally there's traffic. Whoever's got the biggest horn wins. There you go. Thank you, bye. Finally here. Seen this on YouTube. Lots of YouTubers coming here to do the reviews of Seuss. But finally here. Look at it. There's the divide. Oh, let me get some shade first. Hey, get together. We're here. Well, everybody, we're here. How's everyone feeling? Hot. Hot? Yeah, it's very hot. hot. Very, very hot. nice. Very nice. All right. It's the marina. Oh no, boat. Boat tag. I don't want to get the game near me. Yeah, yeah. We'll just get a rest under the shade. The heat, the heat here yeah, is so ridiculous. Yeah, bad man. On the hook. That's what people are doing. You know what people are doing. No, you're allowed to go in the Japanese. Please, 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 Welcome, brother. Thank you, my friend. I have my second shop. If you like it, you look handbags or trainers or. Uh, okay. You want to see? I show you where. No, it's okay. We're gonna have one round. But thank you. Thank you, brother. Welcome. Thank you. <laughs> cigarette? No smoke. No. no cigarettes. No, definitely not. No smoking. Thank you. I help. I put your hat on a boo. And stay close, okay? Flash yes, oh yes. Yeah, oh, 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 I know you. Oh, oh. They got me, they came on a high. Oh, sorry. I'm here.
Thank you. How are you? Yeah, not bad. Thank you. Pakistan, yeah? No, Bangladesh. Bangladesh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How are you? How are you? How are you, my friend? How are you? Huh? How are you? It's on. There's your cat. Da, go record your cat. Okay. Da. Ahil. Ahil, come here. Multiple cats. <laughs> In the shade. Probably get out here. That's the battle. I hear don't go too close. They're like all over. Go to the marina. Where have picture to look? Get a picture of that. anybody says why is he going into the mosque I'm just recording people doing namaz that's not what I was doing I went in and did namaz first and then after I finished my namaz I went back in and took video of the inside of the mosque just so everyone could see
mum in there. I have no idea. I'm going to go to the house. a single tree in mm. Tourists to go back, visit half past one. Every people know Muslim. Oh, okay. Yeah, so they can't go in. Yes, it's a block. Buy ticket to buy safe for more. Muslim now, I think. I have a box for the mosque for the Sadaka. Yeah, yeah. But this is closed only for tourists. Got you. Got you, got you. Okay, thank you. What's up? Master. 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 I'm going to As we're in the Medina, you know, we decided to go exploring down this uh, long side street and take a look at all the different stalls set up down here, see what on offer, see what stuff is available, is it good, is it bad. But generally, we decided to just go for a walk. The building to the left here, I think that is actually the Reebok. Um, I get. I think I will get myself confused in terms of what the Reebok and Grand Mosque is, but I think this is the Reebok. And I actually don't think we, we didn't actually go into the Reebok because I think people are confused to what it is. Um, but that's uh, outside the world of the Reebok. As you can see from all the shops down the side here, this is very reminiscent of what it's like in Bangladesh. It's a crowded, cramped space. Of shops offering all the similar types of uh, like <laughs> products, clothes, shoes, handbags. Stay behind me in the line. Stores. Stay under the shade. Oh. It may not be clear on the video, but it's very hot that day. It's extremely hot. I was lucky we all had hats because I was worried we might all have got uh, some stroke. Well, everybody except for. Tip for anyone going to Tunisia make sure you have plenty of sunblock, lotion, and sunglasses, and a cap or some kind of headgear to keep you from getting heat stroke. Yeah. Let's go back to the no main 
The problem I find with all the shops down these side streets is, as I said before, they're all selling similar types of products. Um, the price is slightly different, but overall I find that the quality is not that great but you shouldn't really be expecting the best kind of quality of stuff uh, in a place like this wait wait for you wait for everybody the reason for going to these kind of places is to buy souvenirs and gifts for people now most of the time they're not going to be the best kind of gifts you could probably find but oh, things that are specific to the country like tunisia that's oh, usually good souvenirs to have so we're looking for key rings that have tunisia on it no, no, and also no, 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 some no. fridge magnets everybody loves key rings and fridge magnets you was gonna make you touch an eagle What? Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay, I'm going to fake and don't Okay, I'm going to. I want to get fake Basketball something. Top. Yes. Fake I have to get some fake from my Four left. Yeah, come on. Watch from by the way. Yeah, let's go get some to eat. Oh, yeah, hi. Yeah, full circle. I see the same spot. Salam alaikum brother Alright <laughs> Denied What did he say? He didn't say anything, just ignored me He was on the phone He was on the phone too Five years I don't know you want to try to run this sword. Are you sword? Yeah. Is it chicken? Yes, chicken kebab. Chicken donut. Ah, such a nice breeze here. Hello. <laughs> Give me a hand, man.
Pirate ship to Tunisia. Whew. You do the. You like this? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, you like this? There, yeah. Okay. How many persons? 50, we do it. 50, we do it. No, Without no. food. Without food. Look. Here, here. What? Here. This one. Okay. 50. Okay. 50. Much more scale. Much more scale. I'm going to say. Okay, you pay me please. I pay him? Yes, yes. Much love. You pay me. I am the engineer. Yes, welcome to Pakistan. We go now with Pakistan. Okay. Welcome. Okay, thank you. Thank you. No, 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 I got food on. Did you? Yeah. Oh, thank you. been a long day today after being out in the heat and the sweat and the hustle and the bustle of the Medina 
it's good to be back at the hotel just taking in the beach getting a little bit of calm relaxation to close up the day